Fam, what is up? What's going on? I want to give you guys a quick update on the Thunderbird here. As you can see, I've got the top off, got it jacked up onto some stands because the front bags were sagging. Sagging since the day I bought the car, back's kind of okay. Um, there is a leak I could show you guys right below here. Um, I took some, basically some water. You can probably hear it actually. I took some, a spray bottle of Greenworks and sprayed it on that link right over there. And that thing, is leaking so what i'm going to do is let this all drain out so i'm going to pull this guy out and see if i can find another uh you know plug for uh this bag i'm not sure if the bag leaks at all but i'm going to replace this first and see you can probably hear it i'm going to put the camera up closer i don't know if you can hear that or not can you hear it it's going yeah so good news i guess i mean um you know i don't know what what else could be wrong it's just you know i can't even drive this thing it just it just really sucks so bad it just starts to dip 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 and there's just, just no way of uh riding it so i'm gonna basically let this air out i'm gonna pull the tires off and probably pull the shocks out and see what kind of condition they are on the other side over here same situation as you can see um you know i don't know if you can see that or not but i'm gonna replace that one as well might as well Do you see that right there you can see some water bubbling there there's a leak in the bag so i'm gonna have to pull these out and see what I can do. Clearly, I got a bunch of leaks, which isn't good. Um, but it is what it is. Older car, this and that. I'll show you the interior of the car. Still needs to get all put back together again. This actually is going to be leaving on Monday. So, fam, I did a little bit of work. This guy right here is the culprit on the driver's side. On the passenger side, as I, as you know, you saw there, the bag is leaking. So, what I'm going to do is probably pull them out at some point. I don't think I'm going to do them um this weekend just because the car is going like i said on monday to the body shop to kind of get it get some stuff done but i am going to go tomorrow to the store uh to kms tools and grab one of these so i can at least get um you know that side working to a point where it's, you know it's, it's doing something because right now what happens is i'll start the car put the bags up and it's just nothing it just you know goes up and then just comes right back down again really quick so I'm going to get it temporarily so, you know, the car can get towed and stuff like that and is drivable. So if they need to move it, they can move it. But it starts and drives fine. Just going to put some gas in it. Going to take the jerry can and get some, uh, you know, fuel for them. So they're ready to rock and roll. I'm excited, man. Hopefully I can get this on the road in the next couple of weeks. Actually drive it around. It's not going to be painted. Just going to be probably proxy, you know, see, uh, some sealer or something, some matte black or some color. Just so, again, so I can drive it around and enjoy it for the, you know, for whatever couple of weeks or month that I have left, you know. But uh, so far, so good. I'm done now. I'm basically going to, you know, go do some research, find out what I can do. I did want to pull one of the bags out, like I said. But again, you know, I don't want to mess with it today. Maybe I'll take it apart tomorrow before I go to KMS Tools and see if they can jerry-rig something. But if I can get that done before Monday, um, that'd be awesome. You know what I mean? But it is what it is right now. I'm going to, you know, pack up and get done. But yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed today's video. If you got any comments, questions, or concerns, please leave them in the comments below. If you know anything about... 64 thunderbirds and bags holler at me man i could really use your help you know what i mean i'm coming in fresh i don't know anything about this stuff and i'm learning as i go you know what i mean all right guys it's day two and look at behind me some well needed rain i'm telling you um i really wanted to work on the car today obviously i can't but i'm going to head over to KMS tools which is just over a bridge here about 25 minute drive i'm going to see if they got the part that i need get it bring it back and i'm going to try to get it in if i can if not, I'll have to work on it tomorrow. So let's head out. All right, fam, I'm here. It's really wet out, man. Um, but it's good. We needed the rain because it was really dry. Forest fires all over the place in our province. I'm going to quickly head in here. Hopefully got the part that I need. And then uh, get back. I don't think I'm going to be able to finish the car off today just because it's so wet out, like I said. But we'll see. Fam, so I picked it up. This is cheap. It's only like nine bucks. It's a 3 8 fitting. Um, half inch NPT on one side. I was going to put it in uh, right now, but it's really soaking wet. I don't really want to do it, so I'll wait till it dries up a bit and I'll stick it in. And um, hopefully this will fix the problem. I did talk to the guy and their Accuair specialist, which is good. Um, but he also explained to what was happening in my front bags. I didn't pull them out. I'll show you guys. But it's such a shoddy job. It's just ridiculous. So what he suggested to me was he can get coilovers for the fronts. And Universal Air does a, uh, does a bag over a strut. So basically... The airbag's got a hole in it. You basically take apart your coilover and put the bag instead of the spring. So I'm going to take one apart. Hopefully, you know, when it dries up a bit, maybe today or tomorrow, I'm going to go back to KMS 
uh, uh, tools are the carts, their car division. And they said to be able to mock something up for me at a reasonable price because the QA1 coilovers are probably like, you know, 500 bucks for the pair. And then the Universal Airbags, a couple hundred bucks there, which is awesome. That's all I'm going to need. And that thing's going to be ready to rock and roll. So that was some really good news about that. But that's it for me, man. I'm pretty much done deal now. I'm just going to shut everything down. I'm going to cover the car up. And then, um, you know, I'll keep you guys posted on what's going on in the next couple of days. So guys, if you liked the video, please click on that like button. Share this video. Subscribe to the channel that we stay up to date with the latest, greatest information. I'm Boyman from Fat Rides. I'll see you guys next time.